Local 24 News, Midday. Welcome back this midday. A groundbreaking clinical trial underway right here in Memphis is hoping to serve as a lifesaver for cancer patients. It's a new non-surgical breast cancer treatment being used by doctors at the West Clinic. It's this morning's local health alert. Really, you haven't had any problems at all? At 76 years old, when a doctor discovered a tumor in Jean Raymond's breast, she already had her mind set. Chemotherapy or an invasive surgery were a no-go. Well, I didn't want to have surgery again. I'm almost 77 years old, so my options seem very little. Uh, uh, before I had been in surgery, been put to sleep for two hours, I'm a heart patient. That didn't sound like a good idea. Having beat breast cancer once already, she already knew having a positive outlook was key. But she also needed options. She got that thanks to a clinical trial underway at the West Clinic involving a procedure called cryoablation. It's been used in other cancers, uh, liver, lung, prostate in the past, but this is a new trial for treating certain women with early stage breast cancer in a non-surgical manner. Breast surgeon Dr. Richard Fine says the process works using the innovative Ice Sense 3 system. It involves exposing a tumor to extreme cold to freeze it from the inside out, causing the diseased cells to simply die off. Eventually, they're absorbed by the immune system over time. This is the cryoablation probe. This small portion of the probe is inserted into the breast at the tumor. Now, nitrogen is actually inside. It freezes the tumor in a freeze-thaw-freeze process. In total, the entire procedure only takes about 20 minutes. Right now, we're focusing on tumors that are small and older women that have very favorable biology. And we want to prove that it works here. The benefits of cryoablation over traditional cancer surgery are significant, including faster recovery, improved cosmetic results, greater patient comfort, less risk, and the added benefit of a lower cost. Older women especially usually have other problems and being put to sleep for a couple hours is not what you want to do. And so this has very few side effects and uh, it's got a, a good prognosis to me. Raymond had her procedure just a few weeks back. She's happy with the results and sees this as a plus for women battling breast cancer. The current clinical trial is recruiting women 65 and older diagnosed with certain forms of breast cancer. For more information on the study and to possibly get involved, simply head to the Find It section of our website, localmemphis.com.